Sean, well done. Almost the perfect away performance there. Yeah, I think it's you know very much you know a. Pro I, I think I'd say it's probably in the top three performances that you know we've managed to um, produce since I've been here. This is a hard place to come. Been in the top three all season, so to come here and convincingly beat them three 0 is a, is a massive positive for us. Obviously, a very positive display in the second half, particularly going forward. But I guess the foundation was built from what you've done. Frustrating, like you say, a very good side in this division. I think you're right. Yeah, I think you look at a full 90-minute performance, and there's certain parts of the um, game where you can, you know, really push the um, the accelerator, and we've done that in the second half. But also, you know, we we understood that in the first half we had to stop all their service and supply, and we've done that. You know, I thought that was a, a real convincing display, and I, I'm so proud. I'm proud of the boys, proud of Medi for the way that he came on and changed the um, you know changed the whole complexity of the second half but I'm also proud of the clean sheet as well to come here and keep a clean sheet is is very difficult talked about many Lolita there he'll obviously take take a lot of the headlines from the game three great goals two from the penalty spot showing fantastic composure yeah and well, we've had a few penalties of late and I know we've missed them but he had the confidence to step up and you know put them both away which is great for us and then the third goal is a great finish you know it's a really good finish from him but listen it could have been a few more. Of course it could have been, but that would be me being ultra picky. I think today's a, a, a massive um, pat on the back for everybody, you know, not just the players, but for the staff alike. You know, we had a game plan that we stuck to and um, it's always nice when you work on something on a Tuesday and a Thursday and it comes off on a Saturday. And that's what we did, you know, we travelled up, it's a long way to come. We managed the um, travel really well and we've, um, you know, we've got off just desserts this afternoon. Obviously you talked about the contrib contribution of every player. I guess that goes to show sort of Will Norris makes really one save all game. Shows just the, how much hard work was put in front of him to, to enable him to get that clean shoot. I think the energy levels that we showed this afternoon probably, you know, culminated in Will only making that one save. It was uh, There was a lot of blocks. There was a lot of um, energy expelled to shut the ball down. Um, but when we got the ball back, I felt, especially in the second half, we used it really well. And um, when we can do that, and it's difficult to get the perfect performance, you know, continually throughout the season. But we've had a few good performances this year. And when we can play to our full maximum, you know, we're a really good team. We're a really good team. I think the key now is that everybody understands that when they come and watch Cambridge United, you know, they're looking at a team who can really compete. You know, and that's, we've not beat the top seven teams too often this year. But that's, you know, that's a great scalp for us today. Yeah. Done more than competes there, got a great result against us in the top seven. And I guess that gives you confidence going into another, another tough game on Tuesday night against Well, Liverpool. that's the challenge now, you know, can we back that up? Can we back it up with another positive performance on Tuesday night? Again, against a team with their own agenda. It's not going to be easy. League two is not easy. Um, but for us, if I'm a player, if I can put my playing hat on today, that would give me a lot of, a lot, a lot of encouragement for Tuesday night.